Hello, party ponies. I survived my workout today. Holy smokes, 30 minutes was Pilates today. And I used a band. It was actually cool. I got out my bands that I had for forever. And one was actually Mark's Roller Strides. Apparently I stole it. Um, so I did that. And I took a shower. And then I connected with one of my friends who's going to be joining my fitness tribe. And it was really cool just to chat with her and hear like what her goals were and just kind of make a plan. And so she said something really profound. She's like, I don't really know what you do, but I've been following along for a long time and I'm finally ready. And so a lot of you have been following along for a long time because I've been a coach now for four years almost. This June will be four years. And I've invited a lot of you and you're following my stories. You're watching me on Instagram. Hey, Celeste, like your secret squirrel watching, but you're unwilling to invest in your own journey. And I want you to know that that's okay because that's your decision. And as a coach, I'm not here. I'm not here to convince you of anything. I'm not here to try and take your money. I'm not going to try and sign you up for jack shit. I'm just going to share my journey and my struggle and my victory and my heart. And if you decide that the timing is right, that you're ready to draw a line in the sand and become a better version of yourself, I would love to help you do that because that's what I do as a coach. As a coach, I'm not an expert at anything. I'm just a real, normal, living, breathing imperfect human that's committed to working on my own journey and shining the light for other people. And so that's what I do. And so I want you to know if you're one of those people that I've been literally inviting the last four years and you're like, I'm not interested. No, thanks. I don't know. Don't try and sell me something. I'm not trying to sell you anything. I'm just trying to share what has blessed me and what has literally transformed my entire life from like my marriage to motherhood to who I am. Because for a long time, I didn't know who I was. Like I was Starbucks for a long time. That was my identity. And, and then I had kids and then I was a mom and I was just super freaking lost. And so I'm really grateful that I had a pushy friend that kept saying, you need to check this out. You need to check this out. You need to do this workout. You need to try the shake. And I was like, get behind me. Like I'm not interested. So those of you who are like, no, I get it. Like you're just not ready or you don't have enough information. And so I'm not here to convince you. I'm just here to share what works for me. And I'm really grateful because I've met some of the most amazing people doing it. And it truly is your journey. And so she, when I was talking to my friend who shall remain nameless, she was like, wow, there's like really no wrong way to do this because we were talking about her goals and how this works and what happens inside my tribe and all the different tools that we give people that we connect people with because we have tools as coaches. Like we're not perfect people, but we have really great tools and we're not your mom. We can't make you do jack squat. But if you decide that you're tired of your status quo, you're tired of doing things that aren't working for you, or you're tired of just feeling defeated, like we have really amazing world-class tools that you can use. Will they rock your life? I hope so. But if they don't, you can get your money back. I'm not here. It's not like Bank of Sarah trying to take your money. But she said, you know, there's, wow, there's like no right or wrong way to do this. And I was like, well, unless you do nothing, that would be the wrong way. But her perspective came from years of following along, literally years of just check-ins and following along and reading the stuff I suggest I suggested and just taking her journey one day at a time. I want you to take your journey one day at a time. You don't need to fast forward it. You don't need to compare it to anyone else's. And if you're some of my coach tribe watching right now, I want you to remember that. Like coaching is really, can be really challenging because we know how amazing we feel and we know how much this can transform others, pe other people's lives, but then you try and share it sometimes, or you have family that like poo poo it and they make you feel bad. You just put your own blinders on and you do you because at the end of the day, for all of you watching, this is your own journey and no one can do it for you. So you have to be in alignment with what sits right with your spirit and take action every single day. So that's that. If you've been watching and you're not ready, I'm not here to convince you. I'm not here to fast forward your journey because if I force you to do something you're not ready to, first of all, it's going to take way too much energy for me. But secondly, it's just not, if it's not your time, it's not your time. So if you have been watching and you're feeling the nudge, I don't want you to feel embarrassed. It's taking you so much time. It's your journey and that's okay. This is my journey and I'm going to continue to share it with you and you can unfollow me or you can jump in or you can recommit whenever you want to. It's a super crazy cool thing. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So in other news, I'm eating a super delicious salad. I had bought these like belt little tiny peppers at the local grocery store, but then I opened them and they were all moldy. Womp womp. So I made myself a taco salad and I have some homemade, homemade refried beans and some homemade salsa 
all kinds of yumminess. So I'm gonna do this, and then I'm gonna put together a brand new page for the people who are just joining me. So if you've recently joined me and you feel super overwhelmed by our like our bigger tribe, this will be like a baby step. Like this is what you do because I think some people need that. Some people overthink it, especially if you're one of my people. <laughs> Overthinkers unite. So it's just gonna be like, this is what you do. Okay, now this is the next thing you do because sometimes you just need to know that there's a plan. So if you've been waiting and you've been holding off because you're like, oh my gosh, this is gonna be too hard or I don't know if I can do what she does. I don't know if I can do her workouts. You're going to do your own workouts. You're going to do your own thing. You will have support and tribe and a place to plug in. But like, this is your own freaking journey. Stop making it, stop trying to make it look like other people's. Mm -hmm. So anyways, if you need me, let me know. You can message me. We are on day four inside. Yeah, because it's a Thursday. So today is day four of our brand new challenge. But I am on day three because I missed, I missed a day. Hashtag real life. Doesn't have to be perfect. Just has to be yours. Do you see the theme, you guys? Anyways, I'm super grateful for those of you that have trusted me with your journey. And those of you who are just not there yet, I believe in you. And I will be here when you're ready. So you do you, sister. I'm going to do me.